to you all and welcome to this edition whereby we're going to be talking about the challenges of surviving this winter during this period of the COVID-19 pandemic. So one of uh, some of the conditions of the rapid spread of the COVID-19 in townships or urban centers where we see people overcrowded, where there is poor sanitation, where there is lack of water and lack of resources and services. We have seen that uh, having these conditions in our in our situation right now, it's of great disadvantage because for us to get anything we need, we are supposed to go outside, stand in a queue. Like for example, for water, we are supposed to be gathering around at a borehole. So people tend will tend to forget that they're supposed to keep maintaining the social distancing. And this will even cause more problems whereby people now are now talking, forgetting to wear their masks. And we are seeing this every day and Probably no one is doing anything about it because we are all comfortable in our situation and we're saying what else can we do in this in this period of time. So also one of the challenges we're going to be facing in Zimbabwe is of how our public health care system is already under a strain of crippled economy where we cannot afford to buy basic drugs and we have less essential equipment and, or even have proper and clean water so for us to keep uh for us this winter it's going to be difficult because of these poor conditions whereby sometimes if you go to the clinic you can see that the nurses the doctors are on strike because of certain things they, they need so you might even get sick and go to the hospital and you might not get the help that you need and you end up dying and so it's one of the things we're going to be facing this, one of the challenges we're going to be facing this winter. So we are supposed to avoid being in overcrowded places so that because those places can be the breeding grounds for the spread of the virus. So we should always keep, uh, we're supposed to be in a clean place all the time. We should always be safe. Let's try to do this for you, for yourself and for everyone around you. We are supposed to be doing this as as one family so the lockdown is meant to to reduce and monitor the spread of the virus but some might not be this might be difficult for some because of the certain conditions we're all in but we're supposed to keep maintaining this so that everyone keeps safe everyone is safe and uh there's no more spreading of the virus so i say thank you